Hey, hello everybody, and welcome back to Fallout 3. So we're here in uh, Megaton. Hi! Yeah! <laughs> now we're here in uh, Megaton. We're here to simply uh, <coughs> go see Moira and buy all of her ammo munition. Raiderside Supply is like the best shop in this whole game. Is it there? Are there books? Uh. I'm. Nice. 308 bullets. 32 bullets. 44 bullets. A 10 mil pistol. I will actually take that. 10 mil rounds. Two combat helmets. I'll take both of those, actually. A, a dog bowl. What? Let's see what else she has. Oh, a pulse grenade, you guys. Expensive though. A recon armor helmet. That's pretty cool. I will take that scrap. Okay. Good hunting. All right. So find a home for Brian Wilkes. We would need to be able to get to there for that rivet city. So, <laughs> that quest is going to be on our quest list for a very long time. Alright, so... Let's get back to doing this. Going to the library. Eventually. RL3 still has not recovered uh, his HP, which is kind of worrying me a little bit, to be honest. Alright, so we need to get to the Arlington Library. Oops. Seems like basically the closest way is, is like here. Falls Church Metro or Falls Church East. And then we're gonna have to walk there. Looks like we might... could get around going that way. We might have to walk all the way around. <clears throat> Let's start here. See if, uh... It's a little bit of a journey. Uh... Which way is it? Shit, we have to find a way to get through. Definitely blocked off. It looks like it's all blocked off that way as well. Let's go and see though. Can we get up on that side? Oh yeah, the bridge. <laughs> My brain didn't really click that there was a bridge here. Oh, this is where we went and rescued homie's friend. And that rest of that way is all blocked off. Can you find bottle caps in the payphones? No. Okay, that's the park that we killed all those super mutants. Is that? <laughs> <laughs> Can 
keep rolling, 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 rolling. Come on! <laughs> Get through here. Uh, that's totally blocked off. We are stuck in this little area. Let's go to the Falls Church East. See if that brings us on the other side of all of that wreckage and all that. Uh, now we need to go in that direction. Night is beginning to fall. Seems to be a dead end. Can we get through this, please? Come on. No, we can't get through there. We've been here before. This is the same church. Shit, eh? We're gonna have to go all the way around, you guys. And our closest spot is Fort Independence. Oh, it's gonna be a fucking walk, you guys. Uh, this is going to be a journey. <laughs> God damn it, Moira. Oh, we need to go in that general direction, so let's begin. Wander through the wastelands, you guys. It seems like there's a location right here that we can discover. I don't see any enemies or anything. On, uh, an item or something there. Staircase that goes. our sword, you guys. Oh, fuck, fuck. Okay, okay, okay. Out for landmines, obviously, there's another one right over here. <laughs> that mine? No. Looks like there's a location over there as well that we can discover. Looks like a little town, you guys. Oh. Okay. Let's discover this location over here that we came to discover in the first place. 
Fairfax Ruins. There's a lot more homies up here. Okay. My boy RL3 is at max health. There's a bunch of homies up here. A lot. Looks like I got at least two on the left, two up front. Oh. Here we go. Okay, RL uh, mur murder catered that guy, that's for sure. Oh my god. He crippled us. This might be bad, you guys. <laughs> oh my god, he hit us hardcore. Uh, should I just sword his ass, you guys? I think I should. need health. Let's use some Psycho. And some Medex. And some Jet. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Shit! Yes. Okay. Sorry. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Fuck you, bitch. And fuck you. No, you guys. Is this the last one? I think it is. Wow, there is so... <laughs> There's so many raiders there. What the shit? Uh -uh. God damn it. My God, there was like a fucking... There was at least a dozen of them there. Sir, I am on the lookout. Right, well, there appears to be... <laughs> There appears to be a location that we can discover over here. cover up here. What is that? Well, we appear to have found a little town, you guys. And Dale. at the town of Andale, you guys. Let's make it daytime, you know what I'm saying? I want to be able to see. Old 
old man Harris's house. Slow down, Grandpa. What's wrong? What's wrong? You don't see anything wrong with a quiet little town full of friendly people in the middle of a blasted wasteland? Eh, well, I don't talk to anyone here, but you, are they friendly? No. Well, yes. But it's all a trick. Don't you know anything? Did you just crawl out of a vault or something? <laughs> just about everyone in the wasteland knows to avoid Andale, and they're right to do it. People wander in here, and they don't wander back out. Oh, well, I'll be careful, I guess. <laughs> you should. Otherwise, you'll end up just like the rest. What? You don't believe me? Just look in the basements. Or out in the shed. You'll see what I mean. I have to go now. Get out. Get out while you can. All right. Simmer down. <laughs> what you got in here, old man? Alcohol all over, I'll take that. I'll take that. Some wonder glue. Rolling pins. <laughs> New weapon to add to the collection, you guys. Well, hello there. Hey, hey, hey. how's it going, man? Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, gotta go. <laughs> All right. The hell? That's pretty funky. He's talking about the shed out back and stuff. Alright, alright. Pick the door to the garden shed, you guys. Very hard. Ah, oh, here we go. Oh. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Night, night. <laughs> oh yeah. Seventy-eight experience points for that. What the hell? Yo, maybe the old man wasn't so crazy after all. Strange meat. You guys, combat knife, combat knife, combat knife, combat knife, lawnmower blade, another ripper, two rippers. Nothing in that box. A whole bunch more strange meats, you guys. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Stranger, I got something I want to talk to you about. I couldn't help but notice that you were poking around in Bill's shed. So, did you find what you were looking for in there? Oh my god. Bro, there's another there's another person standing right behind him, too. There's a girl right behind him. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but yeah. I really don't know what you're talking about, Jack. Yeah, and I saw what you're hiding in there, you sick bastard. <laughs> I would grab myself a snack while I was in there, but that'd be rude. Yes, I was in the shed. 
<laughs> yeah, I was in the shed, man. And did you see anything unexpected there? Well, you mentioned <laughs> there were a bunch of bodies in there. And do you have any thoughts on that? I, I kind of just want to survive, to be honest with you. <laughs> You're a bunch of sick fucks and I'm getting out of here. You're gonna die for what you've done. Oh my god, yeah. Okay. I think you're a bunch of sick fucks, and I'm getting out of here. <laughs> I'm disappointed, friend, but that's your prerogative. If you don't want to enjoy our town, we certainly don't want you here. I'm sorry that you didn't enjoy your stay, but a man does need to feed his family. Nothing personal. <laughs> oh my god, did it auto-save hey right stranger. there? Oh I got no. I wanna talk. I... Fuck you guys, that's so bad. And do you have any thought? Fuck you guys. That's so bad. Fuck, RL's dead already. Dude. Damn it. Oh. Fuck. Hey there, stranger. I got something I want to talk to you. It's so fast. God damn it. I am afraid. I. Oh my God. No! Oh, you're the one that's probably killing RL. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. No, I want him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'm stuck. Come on. Fuck! There's so much shit to get stuck on. Oh my fucking god, man. What the shit, yo. There is so much shit to get fucking stuck on in there. Like, what the shit? <laughs> oh my god, you guys, what a shit autosave. Oh. Did I hit it? Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh, I am like legit stuck in this corner. That's the worst part. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my god, I keep hitting these fucking skeletons. Oh, you guys. We are fucked. No, no. I can't get out of this spot. Yeah, come and get me, bitch. Yeah. Oh my god, yo. <laughs> Okay, we got a magnum. Jesus. Two mag. Oh, we got uh, one magnum tortoise shell glasses. 
Endale basement key, sawed off shotgun, nine shotgun shells. Jesus Christ. Where's the, uh, oh, there he is. See, I can't get past these skeletons. Uh, Andale Shed Key. RL, my god. I know there's gonna be more of them out here. Okay, perfect. Oh, my god, you guys. Oh, I thought we were about to lose our save file there, or have to go back really, really far and load like an old save. No. I will kill the fuck out of you. Jesus Christ. I, I'm fucking killing anybody I see in here, yo. You know what I'm saying? Like, holy shit. Anybody I see is getting the, the hangman's noose at this moment. I don't care if they're friendly or not. Oh my god, you guys. Probably gonna find some weird shit in these people's houses. Bunch of cannibals and shit. You know what I mean? <clears throat> Lots of strange meat. I'm so happy we made it out of that situation, yo. That is a seriously bad situation that can happen in a game, in a game that auto saves. Um, I guess Minecraft would be the most well-known game for that, for like auto saving at like the worst possible moment, like when you're falling to your death or something, and then all of a sudden it's just like, oh yeah, auto saving. Anytime you load your game, you just die, basically. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, autosave can definitely break your uh, save file on certain games, depending on where it saves and stuff like that. That was a bad situation, I'll tell you guys that right now. Basically nothing in these houses except for fucking strange meat. <laughs> I was hoping that we would at least find some cool shit. Lend a hand for Uncle Sam in list today, you guys. Mm. You gotta fight. Oh, you're right. Courage today, victory tomorrow. It's key. And Dale Basement Key. This 
where the old man was. Let's see what the old man has to say now. Good uh, to see. What the hell? There are children. I saw what happened out there, stranger. Those people may have been my family, but it had to be done. I was like them for so many years. It's... I can't even talk about it. The only thing I can do is try to raise these kids and make Andale into a decent place. What's going to happen to the kids? They'll stay here with me and I'll raise them myself. It's a shame that they have to grow up without their parents. But to tell you the truth, it's a lot better than growing up with their parents, everything considered. Better an orphan than a cannibal, I guess? Yeah, I guess so, you know. Now what will you do? We'll do our best is what we'll do. Me and the kids here in Andale. What's left of it, anyway. It'll be hard going, but we'll do the best we can. I just hope that one day these kids will grow up to do some good for this place after all the evil that's been done here. Yeah, no. So you grew up here, too? Sure did. Can't say that I'm proud of it, though. It was all just normal. It's what we all did. I didn't ever think much about it. I married Gladys, just like every boy in Andale married the girl closest to his age. We had Linda, and she grew up to marry Jack. It wasn't until Gladys died that I thought about what went on around here. So many people over the years, hundreds, thousands maybe. But what could I do? I'm just an old man. But you ended it. Bless you. <laughs> Jesus. That was madness, you guys. Oh, my God. <clears throat> well, I guess we'll end the episode here, you guys. Uh, we're at 32 minutes, so might as well. We'll talk to these kids in the next episode, I guess. Uh, we got uh, Junior Smith and uh, Jenny Wilson here, so... Let's get a game save right here, actually. Yeah, man, thank you guys for coming out and watching this episode of Fallout 3. Do me a favor. Leave a like Are on the video. Are you crazy? Get out of here! What the fuck you talking about? I put the shit away. It's a problem. And I thank you guys for coming out and watching this episode of Fallout 3. Do me a favor, leave a like on the video, maybe even subscribe to the channel if you could. And uh, other than that, man, I freaking love you guys, and I wish you guys the total best. I hope you guys have a freaking awesome rest of your day, and I will see you guys in the very next episode. So be sure to have a good one, you guys. Bye, bye. Oh, he's wearing Converse All-Stars, you guys. Oh, my God. Don't touch me. The fuck? I was... You want... You want me to do it, son? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, see you guys in the next one. Bye, bye.